From the spring, so to the summer. And back in March, Miyota Suji and Jeff Cobb faced off for the very first time in the New Japan Cup. Yoda Suji eliminated the Imperial unit and went on to win the whole tournament. And again in G1 Climax action, it was Suji that stopped Jeff Cobb from getting out of the group stage. And Suji made it all the way to the final. It's the birthday tonight for the leader of the new generation in Yoda Suji, but will his gift be his first ever singles championship, or will it be a 15-minute non-stop tour of the island? As much as Yoda Suji likes to talk about his plans to do what no other man has done before, Jeff Cobb can lay clay to do something that Yoda Suji has never done before. Because yes, Yoda Suji made the finals of the G1, but he lost to the eventual winner, Zack Sabre Jr. That was the man that Jeff Cobb beat to be NJPW World TV Champion. What the shiny new gear. Oh, sexy gear, mate. Cobb didn't only beat the G1 Climax winner in May and Don Taku, he beat Zack Sabre Jr. in under 15 minutes. How many people can say that? Damn, can't. Wow. Well, now you've brought that fact up. Jesus. New Japan World TV Champion United Empire G Imperial Unit Once again, NJPW World Television Championship is on the line. That means that the time is a factor. We have 15 minutes on the clock. 15 minutes to win it. Champion Champion belt no and so when we do that, when we look at the numbers, the numbers are so important in situations like this. How long can you beat people? How long does it take to beat you? And in that regard, Jeff Cobb, singles matches over the last 365 days. Jeff Cobb is 13 and six. 12 out of his 13 wins in the last year have come under 15 minutes. All of his wins in the T1 Climax were under 15 minutes. And although the crowd solidly behind Yoda Suji, the time is not. Yoda Suji had to go from being a very explosive competitor, wanted to work on his endurance, and did so during the G1. Was really kind of an Iron Man of that tournament, spent more time in the ring than anybody. But that is not going to help you in this environment. So he us there oh. early. I think it was one of these kinds of matches, if you overwhelm the other person in, let's say, the first three to five minutes, then you've got some breathing time after that, because if you go slow from the start, then good luck with that sprint. Oh, and up the top, Suji is definitely sprinting hard. <laughs> Jeff Cobb not safe on the floor. The crowd in Corcoran Hall willing him on, but Yoda Suji thinking better of a dive, or is he, or is he, or is he? Look out, look out, look out! Oh, oh. Jeff Cobb all the way into the front row. Is the challenge a Do you think he has that time in the back of his mind? Do you wrestle with a clock inside your head or do you just have focused on who's in front of you? It depends on the day. But with someone like Jeff, he's very good at 
he's very good at controlling the pace, just like everyone else. But Jeff, he knows how to use his body. He can fly, he can throw, he can do everything. So he might be giving Suji a little bit of time now, giving Suji the thought of, oh, I've got some time, I can breathe. But then it takes one second for Jeff to switch it up. And then Suji's going to be panicking. Jeff Cobb, very, very impressive inside Cora Crane Hall. Singles matches in his career, oh. seven and two. Yoda Suji, nothing but net in this building since his return to ex from excursion, three and zero oh in singles matches in Cora Crane Hall. And Jeff Cobb now trying to bring Suji in the hard way. No, Suji escapes underneath Yoda again around the world. Satellite into an arm drag. All Yoda Suji in the opening going here. And there's a tackle. Korob wants nothing better to, him to uh, make sure Yoda Suji has an unhappy birthday. My request for everybody to have celebratory Yoda Suji puddings Pudding. has been oh. denied, unfortunately. I haven't had one of them yet. Are they any good? No one more, right? They're very expensive. Are they? Yeah, nothing but the best. For Yoda Suji, who applies a Mexican surfboard there. And now Yoda Suji slowing down the pace some. A couple of body blows, Jeff Cobb from underneath, and that is a hard shot in reply. Is this particularly the, the smartest call to make? Come huh? trying to lift Jeff Cobb. Uh, he's done it before, so he's probably getting a little bit overconfident right now. Oh, oh overconfident is right. See you later. First time these two guys met New Japan Cup back in the spring, 21 minutes, 41 seconds. It took for Yoda Suji put to put Jeff Cobb away. That second win though in the G1 Climax, just 11.37. So Suji knows he can beat Cobb and can beat him in under 15. Jeff Cobb has not beaten Yoda Suji yet. Oh. Oh God. A little bit dirty from Jeff. Yeah. I think Jeff's finding this little bit of the darker side to him. That embarrassment of losing to Suji before has got to be, got to be getting to him now. At the start of this match, it's been Suji, Suji, Suji. Oh, spin side combo. Oh, what a counter from Suji. Breaks on Jeff Cobb. Jackknife, cover. Cobb rolls a shoulder. Now the other side. Trying to work his way. Oh, 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 the bridge. What unbelievable strength. Told you, he can do everything. Oh, it's like seeing. Oh, oh, oh. oh it's like seeing Owen Hart. Oh, oh. And the one, two, three kid. And there a drop kick. Sensational. There is absolutely no area of this game in which Jeff Cobb does not excel. And you could say that Yoda Suji is well on the way to just such accreditation that the proof is in the championship pudding. Oh. Hard blow to Yoda Suji after we've just seen some absolutely beautiful exchanges of holds. Now things are getting a good little bit ugly.
surf in is Jeff Cobb. Oh, now Red Shoes being frustrated. We'll have to reset his count. One thing happens on Jeff Cobb time. That's island time, Cal. Is it? Yeah. Oh. brought back inside we're about five minutes deep into this one and it, it feels like we've seen the whole breadth of professional wrestling inside of it you know not even a 15 minute tv championship match some high flying to kick off we've had some great counters and now well jeff cobb was brawling with suji and now we're going to see some outright power i think this is a dangerous spot for suji to be in oh no Oh no! Oh no! Oh! Stupid, bouncing, and consorting in pain from the top rope gut wrench from the world TV champion. That's it, and a retention. No, not yet. Jeff keeping a hold of that shoulder. Still even one damaged shoulder, he said, Suji fly. Remember, you have to beat me. Yeah, then a reminder, Jeff Cobb to Suji. Suji has to beat the champion. The champion does not have to beat the challenger. Jeff Cobb wants to beat Suji in under 15 minutes, but he does not have to to retain his title. <laughs> wow, well, yeah. I. That might have been internal damage, Callum, on that top rope superplex. Oh, that's not going to be nothing. Come on! This match began with Suji having the high ground on the champion. And this time the champion delivering a brutal headbutt to his challenger. Yeah, it feels like he's coughing up a lung here, can I, mean, I think that, that gut wrench suplex off the top, that might have done more damage even than we can see physically. That might be some sort of internal shot there on Yoda Suji. Rings up the arm now. Oh, and everything Jeff's given him, he just can't catch his breath. And even if he does, it's gone again. Yeah, again, you're right. You're right. Everything. We're 10 minutes down, five minutes to go. And Jeff Cobb will quite happily keep Suji in a bear hug right there until the time expires if he has to. When he wants to beat Yoda Suji decisively for the first time. Come on! Suji and Cobb trading, we're 10 minutes deep, five minutes to go, World TV title on the line, combination, look at this, face broken on that combo, but oh no, the power, the strength, Dev Cobb denies, and instead, a basement dropkick from Suji. The will, the gumption, the stubbornness of Jeff Cobb, but smarter Suji to change up the game plan. Time is not on Yoda Suji's side. We have about four minutes left in this TV Championship main event. And Suji is going to go for broke here and summon up all he has. Up Having conversations with Jeff too, he says it's very rare that someone can throw him about like that. So when he does get thrown like that, it hurts more. And yeah, the old adage, bigger you, are, bigger you are, the harder you fall. This might be a very, very hard fall for Jeff Cobb. This time the air being driven out of Jeff Cobb's lungs, stinging chop. And what in the world? 
It's Sujin thinking. Three minutes to go. Jeff Cobb trying to recover his footing on that top rope. I don't know. No, 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 no. Oh, no. You don't dare go. Top rope super power counted. Blast him with the knee. Up on the shoulder. Sanity cross. Sanity cross. Double two and two and a half. And here's how he beat him in the New Japan Cup. Ma Lo Uno! From Jeff Cobb, putting not on the menu. We've got two minutes left. What's happening here? Oh, what? No. 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 Oh. You don't think Ma Cobb Cross! Oh. Mark up grass, Jeff Cobb covered! Zero! Two minutes left here. Jeff Cobb's got to be careful not to make a mistake. He's got to be careful not to let his ego get the best of it. But he wants to G-blast out of Suji, no! And the bear is short of a shoulder. We've got one oh. and a half on the clock, one minute. If Jeff Cobb sticks the time limit, then he'll still be the champion. But he wants to finish Suji, get his first win in his career, and I'll turn it inside. No, 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 no. We've got it. No, we don't. No, we don't. Whoa! Oh. Once again, size him up, him up. <laughs> and he had a team blaster. It's Suji. Suji not denied. Gino. Oh, see you later. Thousand. Oh man, what a rush. What a rush. When the result is a draw, and Jeff Cobb has retained the NJPW World Television Championship. There was no way. New Japan World Nite TV 選手権試合は15分時間切れ引き分けにより、チャンピオンジェフコブ選手の引き分け防衛となります。There was no way the two athletes that stubborn were going to get in in 15 minutes. Suji wanted to celebrate his birthday with the World TV Championship. Jeff Cobb wanted to... Wait, 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 wait a second! Wait a goddamn second! Goddamn son of a bitch! I hate him. I hate him. Why in the world? They oh, married to the gap for oh. support! They got me and Jeff to sign the same contract where we're not allowed to help. Well, you get fired for doing it from here. Oh, Jeff, you're a G1. 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 You
get a title match. Hurricane Hall right on, telling Naruto to go home. Naruto saying he's the only one allowed to take that NJPW World TV Championship. God damn it. After what we saw, perhaps the, the very best of what pro wrestling can be inside of a 15 minute time frame. I said we saw everything. High-flying technical wrestling, brawling, outright power. We had an incredible main event, and Ren Narita has just absolutely ruined it. Yota, omedato tanjobi. Oh, happy birthday. <laughs> and then that draw, and then what happened afterwards. Narita! Tsubuzizo! Oh, Jeff Cobb is about to crush Ray Narita next. I think, well, between a draw for that World TV Championship, Jeff Cobb will take a draw as good as a loss. After what happened with Ren Narita, well, I guess it's a bit like being given pants for your birthday. Well, Jeff Cobb is absolutely driven now to crush Ren Narita after he spoiled a hell of a main event here in Corcoran Hall. And Callum, when Jeff Cobb now he said he's going to beat you up, Jeff Cobb's going to beat you up. Oh, it's terrifying. That's why I'm happy we're on the same team. He's some of